Tasha Chantel here. If you're branded to my channel, then welcome. I do fashion, beauty, lifestyle, and wellness videos on this channel. And if you're a subscriber and you keep looking with your girl, then thank you so, so much for the love and the support. I really do appreciate and love all of you. So, my loves, in today's video, I am doing something a bit different. Many, many yonks ago, I mentioned that I don't really shop in charity shops, yeah? And we say like the, the way of saying sh charity shops now is thrifting or the thrift store, which is a very American and Americanized way of saying charity shop, in my opinion, right? Because in the UK we call it charity shop. But the term thrifting is much more popular across the board with fashionistas and sustainable fashion in itself is a very important thing. Being able to help the environment by literally reproducing, re-wearing and repurposing clothing is a big thing. And I'm actually happy to be a part of it at last and to fully really immerse myself in that culture of sustainability and shopping in thrift stores so I am very selective at what thrift stores I go to I think those who thrift regularly have their spots that they will go to time and time again because they know they're known for quality and they found quality assurance and good quality pro products in those shops for me I have found a charity shop that just works for me like this charity shop works for me a great deal and I absolutely love shopping there and it's only in a particular part of London so, so I think it's, it's it's all in what charity shop you go to I've tried this particular charity shop in different areas and I just found that the one I go to now is amazing I'm not gonna give it away for safety reasons obviously but I will say that this charity shop is amazing and better than all the ones I've been to before and that is Royal Trinity Hospice Charity Shops. I swear to God, the quality of things that come through that door, I go to work and I show off what I'm wearing and the, my colleagues are like, where'd you get that from? And I say, you know where I got it from. They're like, no, not that shop again. That's what it is. So for any of you in London who have a Royal Trinity Hospice near you and you haven't frequented it, please do because honestly the quality is everything the one that i go in is very like boutique like it has wooden handles um it looks like a boutique or like an independent boutique it doesn't look like what i envisioned a charity shop would be like particularly the ones in my area in south london they just have a certain smell a certain feel and i never feel comfortable in them but this one i can spend hours perusing the shelves looking at what's on offer and really immersing myself in what's on store so and what's on offer so let me show you the bits that I picked up from Royal Trinity Hospice and yeah your girl is now fully in that thrifting world and I'm loving it so first things first I've got a bunch of black things so I got a simple black polo neck right or a turtle neck as some call it nothing really fancy about it in terms of like looking at it on first impression but it's the quality what you find in charity shops you get a lot of real wool real cashmere and literally this jumper is a mixture of wool and cashmere very lucky and I got this for 12 pounds 12 pounds for real cashmere and wool like honestly my loves <laughs> You're paying much more in Primark and so forth for things that are not cashmere and so forth. The quality of this jumper is what got me. When I put it on my skin, it's so soft, non-irritable, and I was just like, yes. What I love about thrifting is that it also introduces you to brands that you might have heard of before. So I got introduced to the brand CAF, which is K-A-F-F-E. If you've heard that brand before, please let me know because I hadn't heard of it. When I looked them up online, their clothes are top quality and they're really, really, really good um, value for money. But obviously not as good as when they're donated to a charity shop because honestly, the saving was immense. The softness of this was, hmm. I've worn it a few times and I'm in love with it and I cannot wait to put it on again. It's just one of those really comfy, simple, but effective pieces that everyone needs a black turtleneck in your closet. Especially if you're going to work and so forth. I commute a lot, so I like to have turtlenecks in my, um, my repertoire, particularly because obviously when you're commuting and you're getting cold and it's, you know, it gets, we're now in November. So yeah, we're nearly at Christmas. So having a few turtlenecks never, do um never do you wrong so absolutely love this what's that on it okay it's just the iron it's just the iron remember to heaven the iron but yeah again it's black turtleneck simple but effective from the brand called calf or cafe not sure how you say it 
The next one's another black piece. So nothing really fancy here, but I wanted to just introduce that I'm shopping at thrift stores and I'm absolutely loving it, particularly this one. So the next one is from a brand called um, Massimo Duty. Now I've seen, and it's silk and cotton blend, right? Ah, oh, again, a round neck top, soft on the skin. Obviously it's a silk and cotton blend. Hello. Now in not normal shops like going into the store, that's gonna cost you how much? A lot of money. This literally cost me again 12 pounds. And to have real silk and cotton blend, like you're getting quality stuff donated in charity shops. All you have to do is wash it and wear it and bam, it's yours. And I love that. And I was so against it before, but now I understand it. And the more I buy from there, the more I just actually value how important it is to the environment to do so. But yeah, another plain black top. And again, I like wearing plain black things to work. I work in school. So yeah, it can get very messy and it's important just to wear colours that won't show it and black is the perfect colour for that. But it's that silk and cotton blend or that silk and wool blend that I'm just obsessed with. And again, the whole point of this video is to point out that you get such good quality items in charity shops. Now, I won't be trying these on, but there is two things I will be trying on for the purpose of this video because honestly, they are slick. Next thing I got, I'm gonna save the black thing and go into this. So it goes over your shirt or your jumper and the length of it is fantastic. Um, so literally, you know, it's a over, over the jumper, um, over the shirt jumper that can be worn. It's from a brand called Bauk Gen, B-A-U-K-J-E-N. Again, never heard of them, but on the actual tags, it tells you who it's donated by, which is why I love this chat shop even more. And it says that it's been directly donated by the brand Bulk Gen. So again, I looked up online, quality pieces, quite, quite pricey. Again, look how much I paid for it. I paid, I think it's 13 pounds for this. And again, the quality of it is gorgeous. It's just, the softness was just like, yes. I can see myself wearing it in so much different places, especially with long boots and a white shirt. Imagine it with white shirt, long boots, and then this and a nice jacket. Like that's what I saw when I purchased it. And again, the quality and being introduced to brands that I've not heard of is a winner. So yeah, that is Bork Gen. And I'll be linking all these brands that I've mentioned down below. So you can check them for yourself and just see what quality items you're getting from the thrift store. So that's that. Right, so I got another black top, but this one is pretty cool. It's from Zara. It was new, never worn. So the tags actually specify if it's been worn, it would say new with tags. It will actually, they put in that detail to tell you how it's come into the store, how they've literally acquired it. So this top is like, let me just try it and work it out because it's quite a fancy one. So it's got the gape at the front here. So that would sit here and your chest would be showing. And then it's like a very thin material, but again, I just like the style of it. Simple top, it would look really good on. And I'm thinking I might try it on for the purpose of the video to show you what I mean. But again, a Zara top, brand new, never worn with tags and it costs nine pounds. Hello, like, so you, they don't even cut the tags out, they let you know exactly where it's from. They say if it's new, brand new tags, if it's been worn once, they're very specific, they put detail into everything and they tell you how the item was acquired by them. And again, I love this, plain black, but the detailing here makes it a bit more fancy, can be worn out in the evening with a nice skirt, a nice coat, a nice pair of heels, can really dress that up, which I plan to. Um, for those who follow me normally, you know my ankle, was not the best and it's been that healing process. Yesterday it was hurting bad. So um, the thought of even shooting at the moment is still not something on the cards. So it's a bit frustrating because I can't shoot like I usually would. I am repurposing a lot, but it is what it is. When the time's right, the time is right. But again, there you go. Black cut out, long sleeve, quite thin, but really nice fancy top that can be worn out in the evening from Zara again look how cheap that was really impressed by that then I got 
right this is the bit i'm excited about these are two bits that i'm excited about my loves like i'm excited about and i will be trying on for the purpose of this video right i walked into the charity shop and it got it was put in the store it was put in the store in the window and i as i was walking in it was getting put out so i just took it off them and it's this oh i lost is the camera capturing the beauty of this blazer like seriously i think it was worn like once um i'm gonna dry clean it because i want it to smell like me it's got like a perfume smell which i just like mm. but honestly this blazer the color of it i'm definitely gonna go on camera and try it on to show you what i mean and i was told by someone to stand on a stool to show the full thing so i'm gonna do that today so you get a full look but um do you just see the beauty of the color of this blazer and then the gold button details oh my god how much should i get it for my loves how much should i get it for 16 pounds now we know any zara buyer knows that no blazer in zara even in the sales are 16 pounds this is a 16 pound zara blazer and it's in a size is that a european small but it fits really well and again clear as day a zara blazer but oh gosh i love the detailing i love it i love it i love it i love it and when i saw it she was like that didn't last long no love it didn't as soon as it came in the window i was like yep that's mine take it down no point wasting your time i'm buying it today okay so that's what i did and it's just beautiful absolutely beautiful green Imagine it in so much different ways. It comes up quite long, so it could be more as a blazer dress as well if I wanted to, but it is a standard blazer, but the versatility and the things I can do with this, and it's just that, it's that standout green that I just got obsessed with. It's that beautiful green, like you couldn't help walk into a room, had that on and be noticed. There's no doubt in my mind you'd be noticed because honestly, it is stunning, absolutely stunning. Yep, so I'm gonna try it on for you. And then, drum roll please. I'm so excited Wolf, for absolutely no reason but this is a good reason I got these beige pair of trousers or beige or cream <sighs> again from Zara they're Zara and I've still got the tags on it they were £15 in the large so it's like a 12 which I was so thankful for my love look at these trousers look at these trousers stop it stop it like 15 pounds not an issue with them not a fault like just beautiful zara pants if this doesn't encourage you look at the button d on the bottom beautiful if that doesn't encourage you to go to your local thrift store and have a look if you're scared to and haven't done it, done it like me where you just really put off by it because what you were telling yourself about them honestly give it a go give it a go because the quality is i iron these for the purpose of this video but there's not a scuff not an issue not a problem not a tear not a loose string nothing and i got these amazing quality trousers for 15 pounds from royal trinity hospice so royal trinity you should, i'm shouting you out because you are one of the best thrift stores out there you honestly have amazing amazing pieces and the times i've gone in there i've got the real cashmere the real wool zara pieces i've got some from arden and hobbs i've got so much different stuff like but these are the ones that i want to show you because of the quality they're absolute beautiful so i'll be trying this on next just to show you what i mean you know i can show you how it fits but again absolutely in love and yeah i'm i am now a thrift I've been, what's that word when you've been like, you've been convinced. I'm now convinced that thrifting is the way forward and I'll definitely be adding it into my shopping that I would normally do. I was a fast fashion queen, but that's not how the world sustains itself. We've all got a responsibility to play our part in sustaining the environment and do what we can. And if thrifting is something you're open to doing but haven't tried, I hope this video encourages you to follow in Sasha's footsteps and do the same because the quality pieces that you pick up are absolutely fantastic. Let's try and a few so you get an idea. Okay, my loves, here are the trousers. <laughs> they are absolutely gorgeous. 
just i'm gonna show you in the camera so you see what i mean but i'm also gonna stand on the stool and just give you that whole full length because honest to god like this is what i'm talking about the quality of these zara pants if you're getting them directly from Zara, you know, or you Zara buyers, you know how much you're charging or how much you're paying, sorry, for these trousers. You know, you know how much you're paying. Let me just do as I said I would do and stand. There we go. There they are. That's the full length trouser. And honestly, like I'm showing you as much as I can, but they're just gorgeous. 15 pounds, my loves. Zara, 15 pounds. Yeah. Absolutely shocking. Absolutely shocking. I'm gonna show you in the camera, in the mirror, the actual buttons at the bottom of the trouser, if you remember, they had like these buttons at the bottom. Absolutely gorgeous. That is why I'm advocating for charity shops like i'm actually on it i'm thrifting now sasha after all these years of declining the whole thing not doing it no eh, horrible stuff in the i am definitely now they've got me hook line and sinker i have fallen i have fallen because i when i saw these trousers i was like how where how is this possible but it is possible to get top quality amazing things in the charity shop i am literally i am bought I am bought and I'm so happy I'm a part of that revolution because it's really the future. It's the way going forward for fashion, no doubt. So let me show you in the mirror as well. Okay, my loves, there we go. Can you see the button detail on the trousers? Honestly, these trousers are just, they're spectacular. 15 pounds. Zara trousers, no scuffs, no damage, no nothing, no stains. Just a brand new pair of Zara trousers donated to Royal Trinity Hospice. Like, honestly, buying from a charity store and doing being a thrifter is the best thing that happened to Sasha, the fashionista. <laughs> Let me show you the blazer on as well because I am dying to put that on for you. My loves, it's giving rich auntie vibes, no? <laughs> it's giving rich auntie vibes. Look at this blazer. It's the, it's the gold button details and it's the green. Look at the green. You know I had to have it when I saw it, right? I had to. I had to piece the two together. I had to do this. I saw it. And the fact the whole outfit is Zara. Now, if you follow me on Instagram, you know that I, sh I shoot outfit looks. So I will be putting this look in the mirror on my Instagram. Now, standing on the chair, like, I got told to stand on a stool, but my love's like, that didn't feel safe. I can't lie. I felt very uncomfortable. I will be ordering a footstool soon for the person that suggested that. I really do appreciate it. But hopefully, you see the vision. You see the vision of what I'm wearing here. These pieces, both from Royal Trinity Hospice. Yeah. Literally. The trousers, the, the top, not it's not from the charity shop, but it just works because it's black, you know, black goes with everything, the Gucci belt and the blazer. Now it has pockets, you can put your hand in as well. But, oh my God, this look. I'm in love. <laughs> Follow me for the craziness of nothing else. Like my loves, I wasn't even gonna shoot this video because my hair was just faffing about and pissing me off, but I got through it. I got through it. It's okay. It was peeing me off, but we made it work. And now you can see the vision. You can see the blazer. And even though it's a small, I can do it up. I can make it work. Let's go a bit closer. So I, got it. I wish it was a bigger size and a small, but Sasha had to have it. I had to have it and you can see why, right? You can see why, you know, this is what convinced me that thrifting was the way forward for me. I won't be doing it all the time because Sasha has too much clothes. I've mentioned this a million times, um, but this was something I did not own and I wanted it and I didn't want to spend big bucks on it. So there you have it. Um, let, me look, let me do a little thing in the mirror as well so you can see that. Here it is. <laughs> I'm too much, you know. You know when your girl will just continue to work and just push until she has a massive walk-in space 
to actually showcase fashion the way I want to. Stick with me, I'm working on it, my guys, my loves. I am working on it, trust me. Stick with me because, yeah. The girl is putting in the work every day. But look at this. Look at it. Oh my God. I'm gonna shoot some images because I absolutely love it. Honestly, stunning. These trousers, the blazer, the black top, the belt. It's giving rich. It's giving rich, auntie, 100%. Absolutely love this. Um, I'm gonna try on the gold one next. I wasn't going to, but I feel like to round it up, I would do that for you. But I hope you feel encouraged and inspired to check out the thrift world if you haven't already. If you were like me, you were just not interested, but you got convinced by seeing a piece in the window like I did when I saw this blazer, then stick with me. There'll be more videos like this coming to the channel very soon. Okay, my loves, here is the beige jumper on the trousers. Again, I absolutely love this. I love the two together. I just think it works completely, you know, and <laughs> introducing brands that I've not heard before. I, mean, I think this one's called From Calf, but I'll check it again. Um, and I'll put all the brands that I've mentioned down below so you get an idea of the kind of brands that you get to access if you haven't tried them out already i don't know about them from your charity shop like it's absolutely amazing particularly royal trinity hospice but um absolutely love it it's a classy look it's a very classy look the two-tone beige together just absolutely works and i'd wear this out i would 100 percent wear this out let me show you in the mirror but again yeah this is a look absolutely love it absolutely love this my love. so here's the look it's just that the two colors together are just beautiful honestly i'll be sharing all images of this on my instagram and i'm pushing my pinterest like follow me on pinterest i'm literally doing pretty good on there i'm growing i'm growing my brand on there and i think it's a fantastic platform for women so if you are a woman creator and you haven't used pinterest please do follow my lead and get on there it's gonna be beneficial to you in the long run um but this is the look honestly gorgeous i would never no one could ever guess i got this whole outfit from a charity shop never absolutely stunning let me know your thoughts in the comments love to hear from you and yeah let's round this up okay my loves that is it thank you so much for watching my video i hope you enjoyed it i hope it's encouraged you to check out charity shops if you haven't done already and become an avid thrift like i am um and as always thank you so much for supporting my channel we are growing my loves we are growing i am so so ecstatic it really gives me that purpose to keep pushing i'm really thankful for your encouragement for the comments for the um different people tell me different things to do to do less of to do more of i appreciate every single one of you on my state on my channel and i appreciate the support greatly we are nearly on 2k like the 1800 people subscribe to my channel like me such as chantel little old me is getting 1800 people now imagine that as a line of people on the street that's a hell of a lot so for those of you small youtubers who are feeling a bit like put off by the small views or you think it's a small number of insta of um subscribers stop that enjoy the journey enjoy the process and enjoy this community building youtube is the platform to do it on and i'm absolutely loving this whole experience so thank you so much for being a part of my journey and thank you so much for watching my video i hope you like the items that i picked up from royal trinity hospice all brands mentioned are going down in the description box below and that is it have a fantastic rest of the week. I will literally talk to you soon in my next video, which is a beauty video. It's been a long time coming and I will see you very soon. All right, my loves, take care. Talk soon. Bye.